here are a selection of the sea trout that can be seen during the daytime but it's only after dark that the big boys come out to play. And in the dark, here is one of those big sea trout, estimated between 14 and 15 pounds, sitting in less than two foot of water, but you'll never see him during the daytime. Fishing upstream, I had hooked and landed a few nice trout, but kept hearing one or two big trout jumping in the lower pool, so I decided to move down and try a cast, and on my tar cast I hooked and landed this beautiful fish. Well, there he is. Yeah, he's definitely near seven. Fresh. Right. There you go. Easily. And we'll get him back. Give you an idea how big he is. Oops, Daisy. He's getting ready to go. Come on. Come on. Stronger than that.
after returning the fish, I quickly tied up a new cast because you never know when you might meet another good trout and luckily I did so. using an 8 foot 8 weight fly rod and 12 pound brick and strain fluorocarbon I have to keep the trout high up in the water column because if they can get their heads down I'm going to lose them especially in the environment that I fish in And another. Oh, he's well over six. Yeah, a fresh fish. Another sea trout. Well, two tonight. One over seven. Possibly, and he's definitely over six. Bit marked on the tail. But we'll get him ready to go back. Take the fly out first. There he is. Definitely a good six. Give you an idea. That's how big that fish is. Oops. We'll get him back. He's ready to go. Sea lice. Yep. Come on, my son. That's it, a bit more. Hearing a big splash from upriver, I thought someone was after falling in, but it was just another big trout. Covering it with an Alabama cast, that's a cast that I have to send very low and in under the trees, I hooked into what I knew was a very big trout. He's off, but luckily, with the noise from the river, and the wind, you can't hear what I'm saying. Give you an idea of how big the trout was. Here is a video clip I shot of where I lost the trout. Oh, that's a huge sea trout. Sea cover and low branches. Now you can understand why we have to use the 8 foot 8 weights and 12 pound breaking strength.
Oops, easy. Oops. Tail bitten off, probably a seal. And we'll get him back. He's been here a while. He's dark enough. Just turn over the net and let him out. He's ready to go. He's up. There you go. And he's gone. It was a great night by anybody's standards, but I still can't forget about the one that got away. And looking at all those big trout, now you know why we go night fishing.